Little saints in the name of Jesus Christ, my Savior. Amen. Today, our word is about God is with us. God is always with us. So I'll read the famous scripture, John, 16, John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, John 3, 16. God loved us so much that he gave us his only, only son to us. Remember, his son suffered death. He suffered so that we can be saved in everything. You can go through all sorts of kinds of issues that the devil can throw at you. But just know that all the time, there is no day that God is not with you. God is with you every single time, every minute, every second, and every single day. Because God says, I'll be with you through the waters, through the dry land, in everything that you do. We suffer so much sometimes that you forget that God is with you. And you even think that, no man, where is this God when I'm going through so many things? Where is this God when I have lost one, two, three, four, five? Where is this God when this and this and this has been happening? Remember, God has been with you every single step of the way. Now listen to this. And to us, a child is born. And to us, a son is given. So the government will be upon his shoulder. So everything is upon Jesus' shoulder. Remember when the earth was formed, when there was nothing on the earth, when there was absolutely nothing, Christ was already there. It was not Jesus, but it was Christ. Jesus came after. When Jesus came, he was born in the flesh. Then it was Jesus Christ. Christ was with God. When God said there was our, the, the, the word was with God and the, and the word was God. There was the Holy Spirit. There was God and there was Christ. So Christ has been thee. So when, Jesus, when God uh, gave us Jesus Christ to be with us, to know what we're going through, to feel what we feel, to everything, the death that he felt, the pain that he felt, it was meant for us so that we can understand, we can know that God is always with us. So he gave us Jesus Christ to feel what we will feel, what we feel. So he took away the pain. So he went through all this to carry the sins that we were supposed to carry. Everything that we were supposed to go through, he went through it for us. So never be dismayed that you are alone in any situation. You are never alone. God is always with you in Jesus name. So you must always take heart that whatever problem, whatever situation you go through, you are the winner because Jesus Christ has already won the battle on the cross. So there is no way. God is always, always with you. You must take heart that you will never go through things on your own. You will never suffer alone. Already Christ has suffered. You should never suffer again. So if you have the faith in Jesus Christ, you will definitely win. You will have this battle. You will not feel the heaviness of this, of, 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 of this, um, whatever problem that you're carrying. You'll never feel it that it's so heavy because Jesus Christ is carrying it for you. In Jesus' mighty name, may we pray. Father, Lord God, in Jesus' mighty name, we thank you for the word today. We glorify your holy name. We thank you that you have shown us and you have reminded us of your presence with us no matter what we go through, no matter what pain, no matter what um, challenges that we may face, that you are always with us. In Jesus' name, we thank you. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you all the honor. We thank you, Lord God, in Jesus' name. Amen.